to build himself up to win a title. But I find it awfully strange. Right, psychologically tonight, is in the same kind of position Shane was in three years ago in his first fight with Oscar De La Hoya. And move. I don't think Rick is going to throw the volume of punches that Hagler threw, though, that. To this kind of confrontation. That's correct, and Wink is very, very accustomed to fighting right-handers. Enormously confident coming into the ring. Hard left hand over the top by right. Ricky Wright is walking him down, tight defense, and right to stage right now seems to have the better of the fight because he's trying to box in this fight. He's just standing right in front of him. Ricky Wright he said that he would provide angles and that... Going down the stretch. There's a hard right hand by Mosley. Flurries to the bum forward and walk you down. That's what's unique about Winky Wright. This in the wake of speculation by some baseball writers that a few day in the black trunks with white trim or silver trim going against Winky Wright and the white trunks with blue trim. They're fighting the unif... There's the hard left hook to the body by Shane Mosley. Uppercut inside, right counter, right topping right hand in that last sequence. Now Mosley with a hard right to the body. Little left hook inside. Down against Oscar De La Hoya, who boxed so well. In the Shane seems to be trying to load up punches as though he's concerned to the body with the left hand. Right comes back with a right. Mosley comes back with a right. They uh, but if he's banging up against a naturally stronger guy, this is a tough fight. He's not comfortable. Shane feels as though no one's ever gotten to Wright's body, though, and if he can do it with hard oh, punches, he might tribute. change things. Good oh, left yeah. hand by right inside. Mosley seems determined to... Get rid, get rid, get rid. What a terrible break it was for Shane Mosley when the car... Round three comes to first round, 43 in the second, 39 in the third. Harold, how do you have it so far? <laughs> Chopping left hand over the top. Mosley searching for... I, to me, bad judgment in picking the fight, but I have to give a lot of credit to Shane because he did strength even more. People who look for the right, who seemed so average against... And he's landing hills where Moses punching to the outside and not landing them. He's catching he's shooting them up between the elbows and to the inside. Part. He's really dominant in this round, just as he seems to have been in the first three rounds. Hitting Shane hard with left... And he had no qualms about doing whatever it took to win. He didn't... He was... A you're right, you're right. Good uh, left hook by Mosley there. Right, but I just don't think that that's the nature. Looking, Winky just stepping forward, stepping forward, and there Mosley lands a big right hand. And another one. Now there's that hard rough hand by right again. And again over the top. Mosley comes. So Shane's sweeping it from the side now, and it's working. You're just trying to just power punch. It's going to be very difficult. Jim, the thousands and thousands of rounds of sparring. Could they have robbed him of his footwork of right hands? That was his best of the fight. And you heard his father say, you're going to have to win it with power. Right uh, across. Left. If he's not going to Right box. hand by right. Mosley landed the left hook. Right. And that left hook lands. Now a right hand upstairs. little bit in the last couple of rounds. Harold Letterman, how do you have it through six? Okay, Jim, 58-56. Hard left hand and a hard right hand. That chain had been hit with. If it had been other way around, it would have been a knockout. On the other hand, right is the more solid defender, and that crowd chanting, winky, winky, winky. It was 50-50, like most boxing experts. But right, you get, now but, you yeah, but, yeah, but you get three to one odds if you bet on Winky, so you go to... Hasn't gotten in a solid right hand. And Winky right hand. And it's interesting, his corners tell him he's won every round. But it, or every round yeah, but yeah, one. Every, but one, yeah, the last round. Could have, Winky, in fact, uh, when I saw Winky over in France, he was with him then, and I read him going in South Africa, he was with him then. Well, Birmingham... But Mosley is to attack, but Wright takes advantage of the opportunity to hit him again. Pops him with two more right hands. Right, hammering Mosley around the ring. And the crowd begins to chant winky, winky, winky again. He was fighting Vernon Forrest. Hard right hand by right inside. So he's brought Mosley's career to a halt before he revived it with the opportunities to pop Mosley. That's a right jab. Fewer than 30 punches and has landed four. 
when you're throwing punch, and then whacking him with that solid left hand. He drops the left hand down on him, and he can't. Oh, crazy, I want you to be ridiculous with the jab in there, and Wright has come out. And you know, it's interesting, you know, at most all of the fights, I always see him in the lobbies. He comes out of the fights, just as a fan, as a spectator. Kind of like. Ah, oh, Wright right with a solid little. See that? It just leaves it there. Of course, we've been in one previous situation where we thought that Shane imagined that the same reversal takes place tonight, but we have to leave open the... And the fact that he won such a close decision last time. The most part, he came back, had a couple of good rounds because Winky cut off, but I, I see, thought that he could do things that he couldn't do. He would be dancing and boxing, things that he's never... So the layman oh, fan would ask this, Emmanuel. Well, let me see. The Mosley fight with Dale Oye was really close. Would you know, I don't like to tell you this, but I just can't see him beating uh, Ricky. Ricky takes a good punch. Very about a hundred times. I rather suspect oh, if he gets the decision we expect tonight after the fight. Oh, Hard right hand by Mosley, partially blocked by Wright. Wright rips a right hand inside. And he's had this experience in other fights where he's fallen just a little bit short. And he doesn't jump in the head, but Shane is out working in this round at this stage here at the last half. You know, but he's it looks like he's trying to score a 21-point touch. Instead, it appears to have been a big night for his opponent, Winky Wright. All credit to Winky Wright. 14 years in the venue. Wright, 24 out of 63. Give the 12th to Winky!